Hey everyone, this is Alex or Polymomo Tea, and today I have a tutorial showing you how to make this miniature raindrop cake, and I hope you guys enjoy. So to make the wooden base, you want to take some balsa wood and cut a rectangle shape, and I'm going to rub it on some very fine grit sandpaper, this is 600 grit, and I smooth out the edges like this. So to make the raindrop part, I'm taking some scrap clay to make a mold and I'm shaping it into a dome shape and I'm baking that according to instructions. To make the mold, I'm using some oyumaru and I'm putting that in some boiling water, but if you don't have that, you can use your silicone mold maker. So I'm putting the raindrop template into the oyumaru or the mold maker and I'm making a mold. And gently I try to remove the template from the mold without breaking it. I'm filling the mold up with some clear resin. I'm using UV resin, but you can also use two-part resin. And I'm filling it to the top and let it cure. And once it's cured, I'm taking it out of the oyumaru. Now we're gonna make the syrup or the kuromitsu. So I'm taking some resin and I'm blending in some brown chalk pastels, mixing it together. And I decided to give it a little bit of brown to have that nice dark syrup color. Then I'm taking a dot of that mixture and I'm placing it on one side of the wooden board and I'm letting that cure. Then I'm taking some super glue and I'm putting it on the other side of the syrup and I'm gluing on our raindrop. Then for the kinako or soybean powder, I'm shaving some yellow and white chalk pastels and I'm placing that in between the syrup and the raindrop. So this is how our raindrop cake, our kinako powder, and kuromitsu syrup looks like, and I hope you guys enjoyed this DIY tutorial. Thank you!